Set up ExpressVPN router app on Linksys WRT 1900AC, S. This tutorial will teach you how to set up your ExpressVPN router app on the Linksys WRT 1900AC 13J1, WRT 1900AC 13J2, or WRT 1900AC S. Note, this tutorial is only for users who purchased the WRT 1900AC, S, from a source other than Flash routers. Contents, get your Linksys router. Download the ExpressVPN firmware. Technical, how to flash to the ExpressVPN firmware. Connect to your devices. Finding your passwords. Need help with media streamer? I've set up my router but cannot connect to the internet. 1. Get your Linksys router. To purchase the Linksys WRT 1900 AC, S, please visit the official Linksys website at http colon slash slash www.linksys.com slash p slash p hyphen WRT 1900 AC. Or the official Linksys Amazon page at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash bdlm. 2. Download the ExpressVPN firmware. Open the welcome email you received when you signed up for ExpressVPN. Click the link in the email. If you can't find the link, log into your account using this page. Once you've clicked the link in the welcome email or logged into the website, click on Setup ExpressVPN on the Active Subscriptions page. This will take you to the Downloads page. Click on Router on the left side of the screen. Next, select Linksys WRT 1900 AC 13J1, Linksys WRT 190013J2, or Linksys WRT 1900 ACS and click on Download Firmware to start downloading the ExpressVPN firmware. You will be flashing to this firmware later, so make sure you select the correct firmware for your model. 3. Technical, how to flash to the ExpressVPN firmware. Note, flashing the firmware will erase any current settings on your router. Although you can revert to the default firmware, users are not recommended to attempt the below without prior technical know-how. Connect your computer to your router using a cable. Use any of the four blue ports, labeled 1 to 4, and not the yellow internet port. While your router is not connected to the internet, go to linksysmartwifi.com. You can also access your router setup screen by finding the router's default gateway. Check the boxes for I have read, and I want to skip, then click manual configuration. You will not see the screen if you have configured your router before. After loading, you will see a screen notifying you that internet connection is down. Click login to proceed. You will not see the screen if you have configured your router before. In the sign-in screen, enter admin and click sign in. In the main smart Wi-Fi screen, click connectivity. Click choose file. Select the ExpressVPN firmware and then click start. You will see a notification informing you that the firmware update will require a reboot of your router. Click yes to continue. Once the firmware was been successfully installed, click ok to initiate the router rebooting. After the router has rebooted, you should be automatically redirected to www.expressvpnrouter.com. Log in by using admin as the username and entering the 8-digit password found at the bottom of your router. At this point, connect your router to the internet. This can be done by plugging your internet cable into the yellow internet port at the back of the router. Connect your router to your modem, if you are using this router as the primary router, or existing router. If you have not activated your ExpressVPN account, sign into your account, click Setup ExpressVPN, and copy your 23-digit ExpressVPN activation code. Click Activate. Wait a few seconds while your ExpressVPN router connects to the top recommended VPN location. You can change locations easily by clicking on Select Another Location. Note, all devices connected to ExpressVPN will appear to be from your connected country. 4. Connect your devices. All devices connected to the Internet via your ExpressVPN router, either through cable or Wi-Fi, will have its traffic tunneled through a secure VPN. To connect any device to the VPN, plug its network cable into the ExpressVPN router or connect the device to the ExpressVPN router's Wi-Fi. The network name and password are given as the last two items at the bottom of your router. You can also change the VPN server location you are connected to or disconnect a device connected to the router by logging into www.expressvpnrouter.com. 5. Finding your passwords. All the passwords you need are written on the bottom of your router. For joining the router Wi-Fi, SSID slash Wi-Fi name, Linksys SSID slash Wi-Fi password, labeled as wireless password on sticker on the bottom of your router for logging into expressvpnrouter.com. Or 192.168.42.1, router login, admin router password, the 8-digit number on the same sticker found on the bottom of your router, without the dash. For example, if the password is printed as 1234-5678, enter the password as 12345678. 6. Need help with media streamer? If you are looking to use the media streamer DNS servers, read the below article, How to set up DNS on your Linksys router. Go to www.expressvpn.com and click on my account on the top header bar. Sign in using your account information. After signing in, click DNS settings in the top header bar. Under dynamic DNS registration, enter the host name you want to register and click save host name. After the process is completed, you will see an indication that the host name has been updated. 7. You've set up my router but cannot connect to the internet. If you have set up your Linksys WRT 1900 AC, S, according to the instructions above but cannot connect to the internet, please, check your internet cable is plugged into the yellow internet port at the back of the router check your Linksys router is connected to your modem, if the Linksys WRT 1900 AC, S, is your primary router, 
or existing router. Reboot your router and try connecting to the internet again. Need help? For any issues, please feel free to contact us.